My name is Flash Isaac and I'm a teacher from the future. When I was much younger, I saw thousands and thousands of people fail jam and unable to gain admission. This made me travel in time. Now I am back with the Flash Letter Jam app and a series on YouTube tagged 120 Days to Jam. My mission is to help you blast jam and as well get justice for everyone who jam has served breakfast. This is episode number 98 of the 120 Days to Jam Mathematics with Flash Isaac. In this episode, we shall be introducing integration. And integration shall be running through the next few episodes. Integration is the opposite of differentiation. It is anti-differentiation. It is converse of differentiation. If a function has been differentiated, to get it back, you integrate. Now look at something. Like I always give. As a baby, you are at home. You play with everything. You scatter everything. Then you hear someone knocking or the voice of your dad. What do you do? <laughs> you try to work, arrange and fix everything together. But a problem comes. I will tell you the problem shortly. Before then, it means if the, before you scatter the room, why is equals 2s squared plus 2. This is a function. After differentiating the room, you scatter the room. This is now the result. dy over ds is equals for s. Once you differentiate this, you get for s. So how did we differentiate? To differentiate, let's say two s squared. You say use the power to multiply the function. That is two times two s. Subtract one from the power two minus one to get for s. So to integrate, you don't subtract one from the power, you add one to the power. To integrate, you don't multiply with the power, you divide with the power. Which implies that if you are integrating 2s squared, what you will simply do is 2s squared, add one to the power plus one. So instead of 2 minus 1, it is 2 plus 1. Instead of saying 2 times 2, no. Use this power to divide. You get 2 plus 1. So, for integration of simple algebraic function, you add 1 to the power, then you divide by the power. For differentiation, multiply by the power, subtract 1 from the power. So, this is how to integrate. This will give you 2s raised to the power of 3 all over 3. So, I told you to get something that has been differentiated, you integrate. So, your dad comes, you hear the voice, you start rearranging, you start integrating. So, this guy has been differentiated. Let's try to get what we differentiated. You say, okay, let's integrate for s. You always add the s to it to integration. Once you integrate this, you know that this is the same thing as integral of 4n to the power of 1. And integration says add 1 to the power, divide by the power. This would be 4s to the power of 1 plus 1. You divide by everything in the power 1 plus 1. And this will give you 4s, 1 plus 1 is 2. Divided by 1 plus 1 is 2. That is 4s squared over 2. 4 divided by 2 is 2. So this will give you 2s squared. So, integration of this guy, we got 2s squared. 
Now look at the issue. Trying to arrange the room back, you will definitely make mistake that your dad will know that. Hey, what did you do? Even if your dad didn't know the extent to which you scattered the room, but he knows that something is missing. Why? Why is that in there? Hey, you made that mistake. So, look at this issue now. This is the original function, right? Now, this is what we made. We integrated, we actually got what we made. But something is missing, constant. You know that once you differentiate a constant, you will get zero. So, it is missing. In integration, we need to account for the constant because constant is always lost during differentiation. This is why after integrating, you add plus c or plus k to show the constant that was missing during integration. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope this is a sweet introduction to integration. We shall come to the end of this episode. In the next episode, we shall answer question 1, 2, 3 as introduction, as refreshment to integration. See you in the next episode. And don't forget to tell your friends about the Flash Learners YouTube channel if you love what you are doing. Subscribe to this channel. Get the Flash Learners Jam application. It is going to help you enormously, immensely. See you in the next episode.